and welcome to the next video in our series. I'm Dr. Fiona Mansell and today we're going to be talking about tubing calves and cows. The process of tubing cows is quick and done only when the health condition of the animal demands it. An example is when cows develop a disease called ketosis. This happens when cows that have recently given birth start burning excessive amounts of fat for energy. This condition can become life-threatening if not addressed early and that's where tubing comes in. In order to treat ketosis, we can give the cow fluids with electrolytes and energy precursors in order to jumpstart their natural metabolism again. This is similar to athletes drinking Gatorade after a football game. We do this by passing a tube through the mouth and into the rumen and using that to give the fluids. The process is similar with calves in just a smaller scale. In order to tube the calf, you first need to steadily restrain it so it doesn't hurt itself. The tube is then inserted in their mouth, keeping it on the left side as that's where the esophagus is. After that is confirmed and the tube is all the way down the esophagus, the bottle is lifted and the colostrum allowed to be gravity fed. Once the tube is ready to be removed, the hose is clamped and gently pulled out. A single large meal of colostrum in the first few hours of life is vital in having a healthy calf. The colostrum is milked from the cow and tested to ensure that it's high quality. Then it is fed to the new baby calf using a bottle or a tube. In summary, tubing cows and calves is an effective way to treat sick animals and make sure that newborn calves get their first line of defense against disease.